Did I scare you? I hope not. No one should be scared of dolls. Hey everybody and welcome back to Freedom to Paint with Ronnie Falco. I'm your host, Ronnie Falco. Today I'm going to show you how to make a doll. Let's get started. In today's episode, I'm going to show you how to make your very own doll. You're going to need a few things from the store. A toilet paper, tube, make sure it's clean. If you have any doubt that it might not be clean, you can have one part bleach to ten parts water and mist the, the toilet paper tube. Let it dry completely. You're going to need one lime, a hot glue gun, a hair dryer with multiple speeds, high and low is helpful a craft paintbrush, a selection of acrylic paints, a palette tray, some tap water, an athletic tube sock, and a zip tie. Let's get started. Okay, the first thing I want to do is attach the head of the doll, which is the lime, to the toilet paper tube with hot glue and my hot glue is not quite hot so we're gonna wait a couple seconds till it gets hot we'll be right back okay my hot glue gun is fully warmed up so the next step is to attach the toilet paper tube to the head of the doll <clears throat> to do this I'm using a hot glue gun carefully trace a bead of hot glue around the head and the toilet paper tube. Use a generous amount out of hot glue to ensure the head will remain fixed to the toilet paper tube. When you've completely worked around the diameter of the toilet paper tube, you know you have completed the attaching the head to the tube. Okay, the next step is I'm going to attach this mohawk wig to the head of the doll. This is a good chance to spin the head around and choose which side you want. This actually makes a nice little face with the right spot in the line. They'll save me time by not having to paint in the mouth. Okay, be very, ow, be very careful. The hot glue is very hot. Okay, I've secured the head to the tube and also the mohawk. Now I'm ready to start painting the face. I'm gonna squirt out some paint into my palette. Oh, it already just dropped out. That was easy. <clears throat> I'm using quinacridone magenta, gesso white, and Mars black. Okay, I know that the eyes are going to have to have white and black, so I'm going to start with the white of the eyes and then use my hair dryer to dry the white so I can apply the black, ink, black paint. Try and keep your hands clean so you don't transfer the paint to the tube or the head. So keep in mind, you want to use a very cartoon style eye. The cartoon eye shows empathy and also playfulness. You want to make sure that the face you create on your doll is something you want to look at every day. Something that makes you happy. That's a good start. Okay, I'm going to hit it with the blow dryer. Be sure to use the high setting to speed things up a little bit. Okay, that's pretty good. I'm going to rinse my brush out in the tap water. 
dab some black ink, and then get started. So this is your chance to play around a little bit with the eyes. I'm going to have my um, doll looking to one side. I'm also going to paint in a little nose. Very small. And I'm going to use the red and the ripened area of the lime to accentuate the mouth. Okay, that's looking good. I'm going to use the blow dryer again and then attach the body. Okay, I'm going to set it aside for a little bit and move on to the next step in the process. I have a bag of tube socks. You want to choose the color of tube sock that matches the design of your doll. So this is green. I think it's going to accentuate it nicely. The next step is I want to grab some cotton fill, otherwise commonly known as polyfill. and pack it into the tube sock. The last step is to attach the body of the doll to the head and neck. For this, I'm gonna use a zip tie. So I tuck the head in and then get ready to secure it with the zip tie. Wrap it around, pull it tight, use a pair of scissors to cut off the excess. All right, that's our episode. It's a really quick way to make a really cool doll. Thanks for tuning in and watch out for the next episode coming soon. This has been Freedom to Paint with Ronnie Falco. I'm your host, Ronnie Falco. Bow, bow.